Travis Scott is asking to be removed from the Astroworld death lawsuit. Just last week, the rapper Drake was dismissed from the lawsuit as well. Fox 26 is Dom Lakeith joining us live from the Harris County Civil Courthouse, where a judge is hearing arguments to decide if Scott remains as a defendant in the lawsuit. Dom Lee. Yeah, in the civil court hearing, which started late this afternoon, attorneys for Travis Scott are telling the judge Scott didn't have anything to do with coming up with or carrying out any type of safety plans. They say his responsibilities for the 2021 Astroworld Music Festival were limited to things like performing, creative direction, promotion, and selecting talent. As next month's civil court trial date inches closer, this hearing is to decide if the case will move forward with Travis Scott and others named as being potentially at fault for the tragic deaths at the fatal Astro World Music Festival in 2021. Scott's lawyer started the day telling Harris County Civil Court Judge Kristen Hawkins, quote, just how devastated Mr. Scott was and is, we are heartbroken for the families of those who lost their lives. The judge later asked, what did Travis Scott see that caused him to temporarily stop his performance that tragic night. The rapper's attorney says Scott observed four different things. At one point, he saw a person in a tree, a friend in front of the stage, a golf cart with lights going through the crowd, and he saw someone in the crowd that looked to be in need of assistance. However, Scott's attorney says the performer had authority to pause but not stop the show and says Scott ended the festival after Drake's performance with one final song as he was instructed. The attorney says the way the show was ended had to be done carefully to avoid a riot, stampede, or making the situation worse. Those who represent the families of the 10 people who died at the Astro World Music Festival say the event was, quote, massively oversold. They say there were safety concerns about crowd control while concert goers transitioned between the two stages, but the plaintiff's attorneys say Travis Scott insisted on having his own stage and not allowing anyone else to perform on stage two while he was on. There are also lots of disputes about when the show should have been stopped. Now, Apple, which was live streaming the event, is also named in and wants to be dismissed from the lawsuit. Live Nation, several of the organizers who uh, came up with the festival, and companies who are affiliated with the venue, Energy Park, are also being sued. And one attorney for the, the victims, uh, the families who the families of the victims who died, one attorney was just speaking just when I came out of the courtroom, and he was reading from some of the text messages during the planning stages of the festival, and one person in that planning stage uh, said in a text message, this is going to be a disaster. And so the attorney is saying that uh, he wants to know why so many people raised safety concerns about the event, but the festival wasn't stopped. Now, this trial for the civil lawsuit is expected to begin on May 6th. The judge is still hearing testimony today to decide if anyone else will be dismissed from the lawsuit. Reporting live in downtown Houston, I'm Domalee Keith, Fox 26 News.